Pat Young. Six years ago, he was charged with causing a hit and run just outside Belfast, drunk at the wheel. The case fell apart on a technicality. Pat walked. Anne Marie Smith didn't. Before the accident, Anne Marie was a history student. Now she can barely read or write. Pat moved to Galway, thinking his crime had been forgotten. It hasn't been. What, your ex-girlfriend's moved on? Well, she died on Caffrey's construction site. You knew I'd look into him, that I'd run into Anne. I'm not your mammy, Jack. Caffrey played in the Galway football team, didn't he? Yeah, GAA, born and bred. Made his money during the boom years. His ex-wife brought allegations of sexual violence against him. Never came to court, though. Friends in high places, no? Yeah. No. Lack of evidence. It's called a pike. You see, it's both. Spear and an axe. A common infantry weapon. The shape of the pike made it possible to dismount a rider. Used by farmers in County Wexford who rose up against the English in a brief bloody revolt in 1798. The farmers called themselves pikemen, fighting for a just and free Ireland. Am I going too fast? Any questions? Yeah. What part of fuck off did you not understand? No. The real question is, why is anyone carrying an ancient weapon around modern day Galway? Kid has a point. You're Kate, right? I'm Cody. Don't ask. No more. Mount and around her. Let me go! Let me go! Yes! 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 Now, we catch him driving drunk again. We'll come back. And we'll tell you. You bring the word about having any of this to anybody. We'll come back and we'll tell you. Do you understand? Get him down. Stop him! Get him! Stop him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! In the car. Please, don't, don't, please, don't, don't, I'm really sorry to bother you so late. I, I should have rang, but... Mr. Taylor, you're back. Oh, only temporarily. I... Come in. <laughs> I wonder if I could rent a room for a few nights. I kept it exactly as you left it. Oh, Mrs. Bailey. You shouldn't have. There'll always be a room for you here, Mr. Taylor. Item 8234. Regulation all weather guard or coat. My second skin. Thanks for coming. 
gentleman, Jack. How's he doing? He looks at me as his next to kin. How sad is that? So what happened? Someone ran him over. That's all he said to the girls. That he wanted to see you. Jack. Look. Look. I need, I need your help, Jack. They're out to get me. Easy, pal. Who's out to get you? There's six of them. With black masks. They said I had to be punished for the girl who was from town up north a few years back. They said if I spoke to the guards, I drove drunk again, they'd come and kill me. One of the masked fellas didn't want to wait. He wanted to run me through there and then. Run you through? They had this picky weapon. I never saw anything like it before. A cross between a spear and an axe. They'll be back to get me, Jack. I need your help. I need... Did you do it? Do what? The girl up north. Did you run her down? Jack, I, I need protection. Check the yellow pages. Jack! feels wrong but you did the right thing justice was done today thanks to you you have a long way to go but you've taken the first step and I respect that Both incidents appear connected by the same weapon, the pike. Must be the vigilantes. Patterning themselves in the old pikeman. In Pat's case, yes. But Nilo Sheep for shoplifting, nicking petty cash. Doesn't sound right. Mm. He calls. So a catcher man squeeze like. What? No. No, not likely. You and me, Jack, we're not the tied down type. I'm not saying we're commitment phobics, but it's a big sea out there, and we like to cast our rods more than once. Christ, I might have to shoot you. Are you serious about helping out? Name and claim it, Skipper. Run a check on Nile O'Shea's past. Find out what he did in the last few years. Talk to his father. But go easy on him. And while you're at it, check out those other supposed vigilante victims. See if any of them talks. Yes, sir. That doesn't mean we're partners. Oi, oi, Skip. Yeah? It's me. I thought you'd like to know Jack Taylor's checking into someone called O'Shea. And other vigilante victims. Right. Perhaps you should look into it. Got it. It's me. Taylor's going to be a problem. But don't worry, I'll sort it. I know we have rules. I bloody made them. I'll take care of Taylor. Just in time. In time for what? 
Happy hour, Miss Henderson. After Sutton, where did you go? London. Rented a flat in Camden. Read a lot. Drank a lot. Thought about you. Not enough to give me a ring. Oh, come on, Anne. You weren't exactly an angel yourself. You led me on to get to Sutton. So how do you end up with Caffrey? Well, after you left, I didn't know what to do. I felt like a murderer. Was a murderer. And I had nobody to talk to. Nobody to... Well, that's when I met Tim. I know guys like Caffrey. You don't get too close to them. He doesn't mean a Jack. He's a good man deep down. Sure, and Hitler loved puppies. What a saint. Anne, I shouldn't have left you. I let you down. No excuses. I, I made a mistake. Well, so did I in coming here, Jack. You're wrong, Anne. the film. Unpredictable. You know, I don't like you staying out later. 